och så spelar vi helt enkelt eh, lite Fallout 4 på ingen roll. Och eh, ja, vi får se hur det går. Och det är alltså en andra i slutet nu. Helt enkelt. Jag glömde en del grejer. Som jag inte gjort det i första episoden av ett av Vi gör det om nu istället. Så ja. Ja. Då får vi inte fler med den här grejen som sitter utan vidare. Det är min handbord förut. Fighting with you and Mrs. Beck. Where is your better half, by the by? They... They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, uh, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? Sean's been kidnapped. But I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. It's worse than I thought. Hmm? You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> God damn it, tell me what's going on. 200 years? That's insane! A, a bit over 210, actually, sir. Or give or take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be happy. Codsworth, you're acting... a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first... Ten 
years trying to keep the floors waxed. Nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> Nothing. And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. And the car. The car. How do you polish rust? What do you know, Codsworth? I'm afraid I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were dead. I did find this holotape. I, I believe the missus was going to present it to you as a, a surprise. But then, oh, everything happened. A holotape? What's on it? I believe it's a private message for you. My etiquette protocols would not permit me to play it for myself. Any standard holotape reading device should be able to play it back. Oh, like that pip boy on your arm. That should work brilliantly. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The missus and young Sean may turn up yet. All right, lead the way. Proud to serve, sir! <laughs> there we go. Ah, <laughs> I 
if I only had a bucket. I'm saying, do I need to help this? No. Still people alive and conquered? Yes, although they're a bit rough. You remember the way? Just across the southern footbridge out of the neighborhood and past the red rocket station? I shall remain here and secure the home. Hey boy, what are you doing out here all by yourself? You lose your honor, buddy. Okay then, let's stick together.
들었어. 아소. 로워. 로워를. 
Over here. Man, I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minutemen. Minutemen? So now I'm traveling backward in time? Protect the people at a minute's notice. That was the idea. So I joined up, wanted to make a difference. And I did, but things fell apart. Now it looks like I'm the last Minuteman left standing.
Who are these people? Just folks looking for a new home, a fresh start. I've been with them since Quincy. Lexington looked good for a while, but the ghouls drove us out of there. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. It's just me, the Longs, Marcy and June. That's all Mama Murphy on the couch. And this here is Sturgis. Hey. Ghouls? What are ghouls? Wow. You really aren't from around here, are you? Ghouls are irradiated people. Most are just like you and me. They look pretty messed up and live for a long time, but they're still just people. The ones I'm talking about are different. The radiations rotted their brains, made them feral. They'll rip you apart just as soon as look at you. Anyway, we figured Conquer would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong, but well, we do have one idea. Let's hear it. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crash vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of Cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. What makes that power armor so special? A West Tech internalized servo system, that's what! Inside that baby, super is the new normal. You'll be stronger, tougher, resistant to rads, and... Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertebrate. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? And I can use the minigun like a... rifle? Don't see why not. It'll have a manual trigger. Just aim it at the bad guys and do the old spray and pray. Now, as for the armor, it's out of juice. Probably has been for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. So, what's the solution? What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement, locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Can't be too hard. I'll see what I can do. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck.
Det är till slut, ja. Hey Sturgis. So that was the bypass word. And why did I see?
weed. No bobby pins. Locks really strong. Locked tight. No more prison occupation. I'm doing with you. Uh-huh. 
Up here. Boss! We got somebody up here!
up here. But I got somebody up here. Let's get. Hold up. Why don't you get down here? Show me that fancy gun up close. Not a lot of. Give you that!
Hey, who's there?
I hit. Check that out. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you're on our side. You guys gonna be okay now? Yeah, for a while anyway. We can at least move someplace. Listen, when we first met, you asked about the Minutemen. One thing you should know about us, we help out our friends. So here, for everything you've done, thank you. Welcome. Anytime. Well, since you say that, maybe you'll come to Sanctuary with us. We could use your help getting settled there. All right, Garvey. I'm in. Oh, that's wonderful. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? 
I've seen it. And I know your pain. My destiny? What do you mean? You're a man out of time. Out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel the sun's energy. He's alive. Where is my son? Where is Sean? Oh, I wish I knew, kid. I really do. But it's not like I can see your son. I can just feel his life force, his energy. He's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. What's in Diamond City? Is Sean there? Look, kid, I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The sight will paint a clearer picture. Oh, Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Ah, oh, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the sight. And our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can hardly oh, hold on, hold on. Spin. Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June, it's time to go. Oh, okay. Coming with us to sanctuary? To help you? Close everyone. We're right behind you, boss. So I said no, 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 it was supposed to be my pants I killed, what did you do to me? I killed, I know, one, two, three, four champions I can't believe it's wrong 